Earth Day may start tomorrow, but volunteers are already working to clean up state parks so that they could be ready for the busy spring and summer season ahead. 22 News reporter Kiara Smith explains why park cleanups are essential in communities. Earth Day is tomorrow and the Department of Conservation and Recreation wasted no time to get the state parks all cleaned up before the warm weather fully kicks in. The DCR has been inviting volunteers to Massachusetts state parks to help restore them, giving the community a chance to get involved in rake, pick up trash and paint at their favorite park for the day. This cleanup project was at Hampton Pond State Park. Elijah from Palmer was a volunteer. He told 22 News that this was his first time doing a cleanup in Westfield and that he could not miss out on the opportunity to protect the environment. And I was like, oh, this, this sounds pretty fun. I'll be able to go out and, and help support and like be out for Earth Day and, and help be a, be a change that, that everyone would kind of need and want. These parks are the place where many people go to gather with friends and family, especially in the spring and summer. But sometimes larger crowds can result in trash being left behind if people do not clean up after themselves. This can be detrimental to the environment, wildlife, and the community. Nobody really wants to go to a dirty park, and if anyone wants to go outside, they wouldn't really want to go outside if they see anything really dirty or like trash on the ground. And I know me personally, like when I, when I go outside, I don't like seeing trash on the ground, and I always try and clean up a little bit. Having a clean park helps to maintain a safe and enjoyable place for everyone, especially those who like to come and go on hikes, go on a picnic, or even just to relax and enjoy the outdoors. It also helps contribute to a more welcoming park atmosphere. And this was one of many cleanups. The DCR and the community have been working all weekend to clean parks throughout Massachusetts. Working for you, Kiara Smith, 22 News.